Okay, so I'm going to make this video quick. So, <clears throat> I've been hearing a lot of people, you know, talk about Kim Kardashian and talk about that Kim Kardashian made it famous because of the X tape. Um, Kim Kardashian was already <laughs> going to be a star. She, she, she was already in, um, a family of fame. Like her dad was a big time lawyer for OJ Simpson, who was a famous football star. So she basically was already in the public eye. On top of that, she was Paris Hilton's stylist. So for people to say, oh, she ain't got no talent. Oh, she got talented because of this ex tape. That is absolutely ridiculous and redundant because I, I swear, like a lot of y'all, I really swear y'all are just so jealous. Y'all are very jealous of Kim Kardashian. Y'all have so much negative stuff to say about that lady, but she's doing very well, well better than all of you guys to talk about her. So y'all waste all y'all energy talking about this lady that practically does not care what you guys say about her. She probably laughs at you guys, especially saying that she never did anything, that she was lazy, and that she made it famous off of this X tape. Okay, yeah, she has a lot of fun, but where do y'all say that, that she's lazy? Does she, did did y'all watch Keeping Up With The Kardashian? Keeping Up With The Kardashian? Do it look like she was sleep in bed all the time and all day like a lot of you guys do? You know, no, she had to get up and do work. She had to get up and go to the photo shoot. It doesn't matter what type of work she does. It's still tiresome. Even if you're a model, if you're an actress, people are get tired. You know, the the work work industry is a tiring industry, no matter what kind of occupation you have. So she goes to her photo shoots. You know, she goes to her whatever movies or contracts she got signed up for. You know, she they even had a um what was it? They had some kind of uh clothes boutique. Like she's done a lot of lot of stuff, you know, that most people can't say they did in a lifetime. But you guys are still tearing her down, you know, about this ex tape. You guys always want to bring up negative stuff about people. You know what I'm saying? A lot of people saying, "Oh well, she did the tape," and allegedly Ray J said that she was in on it and she wanted the tape out. Okay, if she was in on it, okay. What are you trying to say? So she she was in on it and she knew about all the sex tapes. Okay, if she did, okay. But what are we trying to prove here? Are you trying to prove that she's scandalous? Cause let me tell you something. It don't matter what you say about Kim Kardashian. Like you can say all the things y'all want to say, but <clears throat> that's not going to demean her character. She's too far up the ladder for that. It's not. So whatever you're trying to do or trying to accomplish. You might as well forget it because it's not going to happen. Like, she's too far up the ladder for anybody to start saying, especially with the sex tape. Like, for real, nobody cares about that sex tape but you guys. You, um, you know, jealous and envious women who want to just tear her down. You know what I'm saying? For whatever reason. 
You know, everybody want to holler God and holler this and holler that. You know what I'm saying? But then, y'all don't even practice what you preach. Ain't you supposed to forgive people? Aren't you supposed to keep your enemies closer? But to sit here and tear her down like that, y'all need to stop it. Like, find something else to talk about. Find something educational that's going to help other people talk. talk. It's going to help other people in their life and help other people be able to talk and speak up about different things that they're dealing with. But, you know... Talking about this ex tape that Kim Kardashian had. That's not helping any of us. It's just seeing, this is just making us see th- through people that are, you know, just evil and just want to tear people down. That's all it's showing us. It's not teaching us anything. Because, look, a lot of couples. A lot of couples make sex tapes. You know what I'm saying? A lot of couples make sex tapes. You know, maybe it's something that, you know, they want to see how they look, how they look doing it. You know what I'm saying? But Kim Kardashian ain't the only one. There there are millions in the slew of people that have did sex tapes, okay? Couples. And somehow it got out. You know what I'm saying? But just stop it. Just leave that lady. Y'all need to leave that lady alone. That lady is living her best life with her and her kids. And you know what? You making it bad for her kids. Like, don't you see that the... Like, y'all don't understand. Don't you see that this lady, this lady is a mother. A mother of four children. And for you to sit there and, and, you know, put video and put pictures up of her and, um, with nudity and stuff like that, and you know that she's a public figure, and you know that her kids be on social media. Like, I know, um, North be on I don't know if she still has a social media because allegedly Kim and uh, Kanye was going back and forth, you know, about her having uh, Instagram. You know, Kim was like that it was good for her, you know, to um, socialize and meet other people and meet other kids. And Kanye was like, no, nah, I don't want her on social media. Like, So I don't know where that really led to, but Think about the ladies' kids. Think think about you're a mother. How would you feel if somebody did that to you? You would be mad, right? You would be like, why are you doing this? I have kids. Blase, blase, you know, but y'all stop it. Stop, stop. Leave that lady on. Because it's already done, like... We can't turn back the um, time for this has never happened. It happened. You know, I thought we were over it. I thought we were over this. Like, how long ago was that? And you guys, you guys don't have anything else. Like, it's so much more to talk about. There is so much going on. How, how about y'all talk about, you know, that lady that took the um the door dashers two twins and they finally found the other twin talk about that talk about good news instead of talking about you know kim's ex tape like come on let, let's get it together for this year let's please not let let's not go in to the year 2023 on this bs this tragic train Okay, because for y'all to sit there and say that Kim Kardashian is lazy and she hasn't done anything, that's a total lie. She doesn't have to work as hard as you do. She doesn't have to run the rat race. 
maybe that's why you are mad. You know, she can go to to a, get all beauty up, go to a photo shoot, do a couple photos, and get paid thousands and uh, thousands and millions of dollars. She can go do a commercial and have fun. And maybe y'all are jealous because y'all don't have that. Y'all have to get it. Wake up every day. Get in your car. Drive until you get to that dead end job. You know, work. They work the heck out of you. Get your little, your little puny paycheck, and then get in your car and drive all the way back home. Maybe eat, maybe take a shower if you have enough strength to lay down in bed, and you gotta do it all over again. Now she does it. She has a job too now. You know what I'm saying? And she has to do her job all over again too. But believe me, her jobs are worth it. Every ache, every pain, every cry is worth every bit. Because you better believe her bank account is fat. Okay. So stop hating on that lady. You know, uh, find something, find something real to talk about instead of, you know, trying to um, down this lady just so you can get a click in a beer. Okay. And you know, think about if you were in her situation, how would you feel if somebody did that to you? How would you feel if you had an ex tape out and somebody was talking about your ex tape and keep just talking about it, talking about it, talking about it, talking about it, like, when is it ever going to end? So, guys, you already know what your job is to do is to click that like button and to click that subscribe button and also hit that bell notification. So you can know each and every time your girl uploads another video. It's your girl, Everything's Me. And I will see you guys in another one. Oh, I love you guys. Always thinking about you. Until next time. Peace.